Alrighty, we are back with more Rule of the Waves as Italy this time. We have two new battleships under construction as the government of Italy has requested. I'm going to put those guys in the halt for the moment. And then I'll... I don't really want to go to war with France. That hurts my budget. Well, yes, let's run it. Let's yell at Austria. Yeah. Okay. Halt. Yes. Resume. Yes. I want to finish those. We're not here to improve your profits. Bugger off. Accelerate construction. Accelerate construction. Accelerate construction. Get it done a little bit faster. New docks are completed. Very good. What's our research at? One, 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 one. Okay. Uh, that still increases it too. That increases my budget, lowers the prestige, and increases tension. I don't really want to lower my prestige, but I don't want to do this, because that's way too much tension. It isn't worth it. I don't care about high explosives. Medium wing turrets. Enable secondary wing double turrets up to 10 inches in caliber. That could be handy. Improve that. Pressure hulls. Can I build subs? No. That's kind of cheap, so we'll give it a chance. Yell at Austria-Hungary. Because Austria-Hungary, if we're going to be going to war with anybody, it's Austria-Hungary we'll want to go to battle and go to war with. Do I actually want to continue construction of this one? It's way freaking over there. Under construction. <clears throat> finished and finished. Almanac. Austria Hungary. They have two Bs. I've got three. They're not building any. I'm building two. They have three armored cruisers in service to my one, which is concerning. They have nine light cruisers to my six, and 24 destroyers to my... not that many. 20. <coughs> hmm. We'll finish these dreadnoughts. Finished working up, finished working up, very good. Keep on going. Well, go for the win with Germany. Germany's not close to war with me, so. Improved riveting. I have to. I have to. Which sucks. There's no way I can afford to build two more. Back our ally. Oh, good. We're going to be going to war with Austria. Oh, light cruiser. Relatively fast. Oh, I have the money for it. I'll do it. A little bit of weight savings on armor. Good. Now we're on the green again. All right. Whoops. Resume. Normal. There we go. And we're now at war with Austria-Hungary. So we have a fleet battle, which we will accept. 
Wow, it goes straight to fleet battle, all right. Core. Did I start the timer again? Yes, I did. Now, if, <laughs> if I know anything, this is going to go badly. Do that. Do that. Knowing my luck, this will go poorly. So there's some of their armored cruisers. What are we looking at? Uh, eight seven inch guns. I do twenty two knots. Don't displace all that much in terms of tonnage. And we just keep following them. Oh, it's a night fight too. Oh goody. Might work to my advantage. I've got a bunch of destroyers here with me. Of course the destroyers are just doing what destroyers do, which is not very helpful. What are you? And why are you way the frick out there? What do we run into? Oh, there's their battle fleet. They frick we just barely missed, missed each other. Send in the destroyers. Oh fuck, what the battleships run into. All the destroyers of the enemy fleet. That's what they've run into. Oh my god, look at them all. Turn away. Turn away, turn away, turn away. <laughs> now our fleet has turned into itself. Has anyone even hit the hit each other? Nope. No one. Oh, we did hit the light cruiser. But no one's hitting anything, really. That's one of the bees with its 9 inch guns, so it's completely helpless against my battleships. Near miss. I'd love to get some shots off at those bees. It's just all these destroyers, though. I cannot afford to have my guys sunk. And with this current situation, it's not something I can afford to have happen. Granted, their destroyer, their battleships probably have torpedoes. Which is a little bit problematic. I don't like this night fight. It's like the fleets are this close to each other. There's not a heck of a lot that I can do at the moment. Ooh. Might have a guy isolated. Might be able to get one of them. Oh. Two torpedoes went in, and none of them hit. That was brilliant by our, on the part of our light cruiser there, but it didn't work. No, he's going to get away. And our guys can't hit him. <laughs> oh god. Why? Why Marco Polo? Why? Why do you have to do that? Now we gotta go over there and cover you. 
a freaking numbskull. So they've just ran into something there. Oh, the armored cruiser ran into a battleship. So we're losing the <laughs> Nemo. 19 knots. You didn't take a hell of a lot of hits there. Electrical power has been restored. We ran into an armored cruiser. No, you ran into a battleship that's smaller than you. <laughs> <clears throat> Battleships are so small, our guys are mistaking them for armored cruisers. Okay, so what you guys are going to do is pass alongside the enemy battleship here that is stationary. And you're going to cover our armored cruiser as it gets back up to speed. Polo has been hit, went right through. <laughs> the guns are the bat the enemy the guns on the enemy dreadnoughts are so small they count as medium hits. Oh no, they're six inch guns that they've been firing still. Please sink that thing. Fire torpedoes at it. And then go after that guy. Here comes the Napoli. It's like it's a stationary battleship and no one can hit it with anything. Is really unfortunate. I'm not even sure if we've hit it with. Oh, there goes a torpedo. There goes a torpedo. And. Boom? No? Yes! So now to go after this guy. Get him involved with that. Probably fast enough to get away though. 22 knots. They're in the midst of destroyers, so you're probably not having fun. And one of them might hit something. Espresso's been hit. Of course. Three light hits with four inch guns, and you're going down. Now I'm going to have to build more destroyers now. Someone fire torpedoes at it. You're so damn close, and it's so you're surrounding it. You still freaking miss. And you missed. Nope, you hit it. Good. Now there's another spread of torpedoes away. There you go. Very good. Very good. Very good. Screw you, Austria. Fuck you. <laughs> so I'll probably lose two destroyers. But we get a battleship and an armored cruiser out of it, which is adequate. Very good. Oh, and there's a freaking destroyer in the midst of everything. Maybe we'll get him to it. Unlikely. In fact, you guys just head back in that direction. Oh, what just happened? Nope, it's still night. Sink the Cobra class, please. Ooh, another torpedo away. 
What? I don't know who fired that torpedo. But that is the timer for this episode, as we have a much better start with Italy than we did with Austria. See you next time.